parachute has deployed and we are seeing significant deceleration. Touchdown confirmed. Richard Air, safely on the surface of Mars. NASA's Perseverance rover has successfully landed on the Mars. This is the first picture from the Perseverance rover's robotic arm. Mars 2020 is a Mars rover mission by NASA's Mars Exploration Program that includes the rover Perseverance and the small robotic helicopter Ingenuity. Mars 2020 was launched on Atlas V launch vehicle on 30th July 2020 and the confirmation of the touchdown in Jezero crater on Mars on 18th February 2021. Perseverance is a SUV-sized Mars rover designed to explore the Jezero crater on Mars as a part of Mars 2020 mission. Perseverance carries seven scientific investigations and possesses a total of 19 cameras and two microphones. The rover is also carrying a mini helicopter Ingenuity. Perseverance has four science objectives. Looking for habitability, seeking biosignatures of possible past microbial life, catching samples by collecting samples of rocks and soils, preparing for humans, testing oxygen production from the Martian atmosphere. There are seven instruments for the rover. Planetary instrument for X-ray lithochemistry to determine the final scale elemental composition of Martian surface materials. Radar imager for Mars subsurface experiment, a ground penetrating radar to image different ground densities, layers, buried rocks so and to detect the underground water ice. Mars environmental dynamics analyzer, a sensor that measures temperature, wind speed, direction, pressure, relative humidity, radiation and the dust particles size and shape. Mars oxygen is to experiment an exploration technology investigation that will provide a small amount of oxygen from the Martian atmosphere CO2. Supercam, an instrument that can provide imaging chemical composition analysis from the distance. Mastcam Z, a stereotopic imaging system with ability to zoom. Scanning habitable environments with the Raman and luminescence for organic and chemicals an ultraviolet Raman spectrometer that uses a fine-scale imaging and a UV laser to determine fine-scale mineralogy and detect organic compounds. This mission was explored the Jezero crater, which scientists speculate was a 250-meter lake about 3.9 billion years ago. Jezero today features a prominent river delta where the water flowing through it deposited much sediments over the billions and billions of years, which is extremely good at preserving biosignatures. And at the last, the Fetch robot for returning the samples expected to launch in 2026. The landing and the surface operation of the Fetch rover would take place early in 2029. And the earliest return to the Earth will be around 2031.